What's going on everybody? Welcome back. And today we are at our final full park day. We have had a very, very eventful morning. Let's see, we started out good. We woke up, we were cranking, we threw a fit. After we threw a fit, we threw another fit. Then we had a depressing time with Mickey and now we're starting to finally wake up. This has been a very, very eventful day. Maybe we can turn it around with some rides here in a little bit. Uh, we'll see. Uh, we're gonna go s finish our documentary here today. We're finishing up a lot of stuff today. But first, we're gonna head into the confectionery, uh, grab Ash or something from in here. <laughs> Asher, what's that? Hmm? Is that a lollipop? Yeah. Is it good? Yeah. She's been asking for a lollipop this entire trip. So, our last day here, why not? You know? All right, we have reservations to meet Ariel at uh, 10.30. Um, so that means we're gonna start stacking lightning lanes. We're gonna come over here and just goof off. Probably head to Pirates of the Caribbean, uh, just because it's never a wait this early in the morning. So uh, we'll head over there. We're gonna scout out our fireworks recording spot for tonight, and then make our way over into Pirate Land. I know it's Adventure Land, but I call it Pirate Land. All right, so we got our final spot for the fireworks recording tonight. Check it out. Although things, as before, it looks different on GoPro than it will in real life. We're gonna go find a place up front and record intros and then make our way into Adventureland. Whew, man. One thing about Disney I'm not gonna miss is this humidity. If you go with the sword too, then not already. Well, my brother's not very good, but there's no sword. Like... Asher, look at her bow. I'll show you my bow since you're a knight here in sale. This is my bow. I bring it with me wherever I go. You must be a good archer then, not are you? All right, friends, we just got off under the sea journey of the little mermaid and we met ariel in her grotto uh so right now we are on our way to storybook circus to ride dumbo it's uh today's definitely going to be a day where we rack up a buttload of rides and characters today it is our last day so we are i am going crazy uh so we're gonna do dumbo next then we're gonna do Barnstormer. Then after Barnstorming, we're gonna do Mad Tea Party. Uh, I'm telling you, we are hitting everything in succession around this park. Uh, trying to get at least six, five, six rides before lunch. We have a dining reservation at Crystal Palace. This will be our first opportunity to eat here. So it'll be great. So let's make our way on in to Dumbo the Ride. I'm not going to get a video of this ride instead. I'm going to get Asher's reaction to the, the ride. So uh, let's head on in. Friends, we just got off Dumbo the ride. Let him play in the queue for about 20 minutes. Burn up some energy. Gave me an AC break, so everybody gets what they want. Let's move along. And now we're gonna make our way up towards it, 
fantasy land and we're gonna hit two rides over here starting with mad tea party friends we just got off Tomorrowland Speedway and it is a very very hot day so what do you do when you're getting really really hot and the kids getting hot and sweaty too we ride an indoor ride and we have Buzz Lightyear Space Ranger spin reserved so we're gonna head over here into Tomorrowland chill in the AC for a little bit take a break from the heat ride the ride and then uh, we'll see what's next no, stop that! I'm indestructible, do you hear? Indestructible! <laughs> Alright friends, we just got off base. I always mess it up. Buzz Lightyear Space Ranger Spin. Got a video for it and there's this one, there's always that one person in every park that just wants to be a dick just because they can. And there was this one guy at Buzz Lightyear that was just a dick for no reason. Like, I get it, it's hot and you wanna sit here and make a big deal about something small that's not even bothering anybody. But there's no reason to be a dick about it. You're supposed to be bringing people, making people wanna come back. Not making people wanna punch you in the face. But anyway, we have reservations for lunch at 1.30. It's about 12.30 now. So we're gonna head over here and ride Pirates of the Caribbean. And then we're... Then we're going to go check in for our lunch reservation with Winnie the Pooh. We were looking for slushies but couldn't find them. So now I'm coming over here. Maybe get a Dole Whip and share it with Asher. And come on, you can't go wrong with Dole Whip, especially in the heat. So let's go into Adventureland. All right, friends, we just got off of Pirates of the Caribbean. It's approximately 1.33. So that means we need to start making our way towards our dining reservation for 2 o'clock. I was trying to get it moved to 1.30, but I couldn't, so that's why we went ahead and rode Pirates. Uh, such a relaxing ride. It was fun though. Still fun, Asher enjoys it. Uh, so we'll go to lunch at Crystal Palace. Our final dining reservation and our final character dining, which totals our character dining for this trip to six. Six character dining restaurants this trip alone. It's, it's been a crazy, 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 crazy trip. I'm kind of glad this is our final dining reservation. So it's great. So we're gonna go in here, eat, meet some more characters. And then after we get done, we're gonna be watching the Festival of Fantasy Parade, hoping we can get in and get out before three o'clock. Uh, he really wants to see the parade. So we'll just have to play by ear and see what happens. That's our best buddy. Well, over here. Who is it? What does he do? Show him how you bounce. Just bounce with him, bounce with him. <laughs> I 
you can't bounce higher. Can you shake your booty and then jump? All right, everybody, we just got out of Crystal Palace. And not a bad character dining last. We've been to six of them total since this trip. Um, it was not the worst, but it was not the best. But he did get to meet the characters, all of them, two times during uh, our lunch. The food wasn't too bad. Um, if I had to rate all of our character dinings as to which one stood out the most, it would have to be Tusker House and Garden Grill would be the top two. Chef Mickey's is kind of, yeah, we probably won't go back there anymore. Um, let's see, what else did we do? Hollywood and Vine was great as always. Uh, so now we're gonna do the Festival of Fantasy Parade. I wanna get, I wanna reshoot my uh, parade video. I did it kind of messed up our first day here. So I wanna redo it, uh, make it look a little bit better. Uh, before we dip out and we don't have the opportunity to. So we're gonna do Festival of Fantasy Parade, then go back to Adventureland and ride the magic carpets of Aladdin. So we just got done with uh, Festival of Fantasy Parade and I just had a first. My camera shut off because it was so hot. So I picked up my GoPro and recorded the rest. It's gonna be so messed up anyway. I already have a full recording of it. I guess we'll just have to take the two and pick out the best out of both of them to make one. It's not such a bad idea though. All right, so we're gonna make our way back into Adventureland. Man, I wish Splash Mountain was open. Whew. It is hot. This is probably the hottest day since we've been here. So anyway, we're gonna make our way over to the Magic Carpets of Aladdin and then no, it's going into Fantasyland. We're gonna go to It's a Small World and then do some more character meet and greets. Oh. All right, so we just got off Magic Carpets of Aladdin and now we're doing something we didn't do in December or last year, Swiss Family Treehouse. Actually, what do you think? It's pretty cool, huh? Wonder how high this thing goes. Asher, look at this. Look. Asher. Asher, what's that in the table? What, what kind of fruit is that? Is it a pineapple? Yeah, pineapple. I don't have it on. More stairs. More stairs. Yeah. Isn't that awesome? We're miles away. Miles away, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Look at the little bitty bed, huh? Daddy, Asher, Asher, back up, baby. This place is so cool. Oh, I told you you'd like it. Asher, look. Asher, come here, look. Oh, yeah. 
All right, friends, we just got off, uh, got done doing Swish Family Treehouse. Um, you think so? He loved it. Going up the treehouse, he loved it. He said, oh man, dad, this is so cool. It's great. Great to take him on something that has nothing to do with thrills and excitement and Disney characters. But we're not gonna stop there. We're gonna make our way into Liberty Square. There are two things I wanna check out there. One is Liberty Bell and two is the riverboat. Uh, we have talked about doing rides on the riverboat, but never really got around to it because we had so much going on. We have to wait for our reservation to see Mickey. So we're gonna go into Liberty Square and ride the riverboat. Do we have a good page for our autograph book? It's actually the first page. The first page? Mickey Mouse, you get to sign the first page. Hey, look. This is Open it for him, baby. Yeah, get that perfect first page ready for him. cavalcade that comes through here usually uh usually at the end of the day right at five o'clock uh we're getting down to the last couple of hours and we're kind of running out of stuff to do <laughs> uh we like to get everything done right before we wait for uh fireworks uh, with the amount of people that are here today it'll be two hours easily we'll be there for two hours uh but that's fine that's fine because uh, we're kind of running out of stuff to do. So we'll get some Casey's Corner and then, you know, have a picnic. That's what Asher calls it. She pulls him out of the stroller. We sit down on the concrete and we have a picnic while we wait for fireworks. But in the meantime, we're going to head over to Fantasyland. We're going to ride It's a Small World. I do believe that is the last POV of Magic Kingdom that I need. We talked about doing uh, Monsters, Inc. Laugh Floor. But I just, I really don't want to travel from Fantasyland all the way to Tomorrowland and then back here to Main Street. It's just a lot of walking and it's hot. Uh, so we'll probably do It's a Small World and then probably try to meet some more characters. You know, we've got four over there. So we might be able to squeeze in to all four. Uh, I do know there was a 60 minute standby for Cinderella and Elena. I'm not sure what it is for Tiana, Tiana, whatever her name is, and Rapunzel, but we'll just have to wait and see when we get over there. Last time I was on this ride, it broke down for 10 minutes. Now, 10 minutes may not sound like a long time, but when you're stuck on It's a Small World for 10 minutes and the music is still playing, it is not a good time. It is not a good time. 
I got off that ride and the only thing I could think about is that damn song was stuck in my head for like three hours. So no, no, let's let's not do that. But we're gonna head over to Fantasyland to It's a big world. All right, friends, just got out of It's a Small World. That is the most scuffed recording of a ride I have ever done. They stopped like three times. So every time it stopped, I stopped recording. And then when it started back up, I started back up. And there's something, not much more I can do. You know, so, but now we're heading to something different. Mickey's Fill Our Magic. We've never done it, never been in it. It's a 3D movie. We gotta burn some time before, you know, seven o'clock. It's about 6.15 right now. So we're gonna go in here, burn some time, and then after that, we'll go to dinner. This will be our last experience of the day as we gotta start getting ready for Happily Ever After. Uh, so let's head into Mickey's Fill Our Magic. All right, friends, we just got out of Mickey's Fill Our Magic. That was pretty interesting. That was sweet. What's up, dude? Just you and me? Yeah, we're going, are we going to get it? Yep, just you and me. Is that what you want? Yeah. All right. Let's get it. He wants to eat dinner with me. Today he's been on a trip about you and me, you and me, you and me, you and me. Uh, I think it's great. But uh, we're going to, I enjoyed the show. I thought it was pretty neat, pretty cool. Asher was really into it. He really enjoyed it. Um, he was super excited when Tinkerbell came across the screen, so it's really neat. I thought it was very well put together, too. I'm surprised I hadn't went over there and seen it, you know, sooner. But uh, we did a lot of stuff this trip we didn't do last trip, so it's been great. This has definitely been one of the best trips, and it's not even over with yet. We still have a whole other day left. Uh, we still have tonight, and we still have tomorrow. Tomorrow we have Halloween party and then we're done. But the more important part about tomorrow is we don't have to wake up until 6.30. So we get to sleep in tomorrow. So we'll sleep in, hang out at the resort and till afternoon and then <laughs> Halloween party, here we come. But right now we're gonna head over to Cosmic Rays and have dinner. We're probably gonna, we're probably gonna wrap this up right now um, cause we're not gonna do, we're not gonna do anything else. Uh, after dinner, we're going to wait for fireworks. So I'll finish up my uh, Happily Ever After documentary part tonight. And um, uh, that's going to do it. Uh, I appreciate everyone watching. Don't forget to hit the subscribe button, turn on notifications. And we will see you guys tomorrow from Mickey's Not So Scary Halloween Party. Peace.